Hello everybody! Welcome back to Kingdom Come Deliverance! Uh, so yeah, been a day or two since the last uh, session. Everything's still loading in and, uh... Okay, so, um, yeah, shit's happening. Uh, according to this, um, a messenger galloped into Talmberg with a report that Ishtvan's reinforcements are approaching. A battle seems inevitable. When you're ready, go to the battleground. Uh, so this battle is about to begin. I better have something to eat and sleep a little while I can. God knows when I'll have another opportunity. Well, if I recall, I think we're good on nourishment and energy. Well, nourishment we can do a bit better on. Uh, but energy we're okay on. Uh, what do we got for skills? Horsemanship went up. That's cool. Uh, let's see here. Don't think we're gonna need this, but knight... Jockey, a horse will never throw you outside of combat. I don't think we've ever been thrown by a horse outside of combat. Uh, knight, you get a 15% damage bonus in mounted combat with both ranged and melee. Now, we don't use it often, but... Heavy duty pony, your horse can carry more, but is slower. Can't be combined with racehorse. Rider in the storm. Some skittish in storms will shy less in other weather. We're gonna go with knight. Okay, so we got that. We still have one more. Stealth went up. Don't think we're going to need that, but let's check it. Uh, let's see. Committing a crime. Crouching chameleon. When crouching without movement, you get a 30% stealth bonus. Could use that. Stealth kill. Allows you to kill from stealth. You have to have a dagger. Ooh. We don't own a dagger. We'll go with the chameleon one. And skills. We got plus one vitality. Marathon Man, Sprinter, Human Dustbin, Berserker. As soon as your health falls to minimum, no. Last Gasp. You'll survive an otherwise fatal blow and your health will even regenerate by 20%. Only activates... Only activated once in combat. Revenant. You'll... Oh! Oh, yeah, no, we're gonna regain health gradually. That's great. That's gonna save us so much. Is that everything? I think that's everything. Okay, I'm just going to double check all our stuff. Do we need anything else? Food? We don't have any food, do we? No. And I don't think we have any on our person. Now we got some dried fruit, so let's eat some of this. Just to get our nourishment up. Oh, that was a savior schnapp. Didn't mean to do that, but okay. What the fuck? Why is everything so bright? Uh, hold on. We're gonna we're gonna take a nap and we're gonna see if this fixes anything. We're gonna sleep. I think the gap. Something went wrong here. We're gonna sleep for an hour. Something's going on with the game, guys. It's starting to get stable. It's starting up to to unstabilize itself. Oh, what the fuck? Oh, we ate... Oh, shit. That's what it is, isn't it? Nighthawk potion effect. Shit. <laughs> yeah, probably should have been paying more attention to that, huh? Well, fuck. Uh, okay. So that's a thing. Um... Okay. Well, my eyes are dilated. Apparently that's what this means. Uh, I'm trying to find a pot. Henry, I'm glad you came. Yeah, it's okay. Uh, I'm gonna eat from this. Okay, I think we're good on nourishment. 91, we're good. Okay, yeah, no, this is starting to hurt my eyes, but uh, we'll just have to let it uh, run out. Mount. Let's see, can we wait another hour? And this might be it. It's, yeah, it's all right. It's it's still shit, but it's not as bad, and we're pretty close to having it uh, to having it like wear out. So let's uh, let's head over to the battle site on Bucephalus here, because if I check this, where's it going to be at? When you're ready, go to the battleground. Okay. All right. This is going to be interesting. So, yeah. 
I think this is going to be the last, like, stretch of quests. I don't know for certain, because I don't really read a lot ahead on or watch any Let's Plays about this game uh, past the point that I'm, like, playing at when I'm, uh, when I watch them. So, I've never seen anything past, uh, actually, I've never seen any anybody play anything past the Monastery quests uh, in any of my, like, watches, so... Uh, I don't know how long this is going to take, but I've been told that this, uh, this game kind of, uh, has a, uh, uh, once you get to the siege quest, uh, like, the siege quest that I was at before, you're about two to four hours from the end game, and we're right around that point, so, let's see if this, uh, let's see if that's true. I'm ready to fight. I've got, uh, I've, I'm well rested, I've eaten, I've had my eyes dilated for the last three hours, and, uh, just kind of waiting. Ha. <sighs> it's kind of, I'm gonna miss playing this game, it's been, like, we've been playing it for a long time now that I think about it. Quite a long time. Because it's, uh, I forget when it came out exactly, but it's been almost, I don't know how many episodes will be when we finish this, so I'm gonna guess it's, get, it's gonna get close to 70. Which will be nearly the longest game I've ever had on the channel, because uh, my longest one was Battlestar Galactica Deadlock, which was, I think it was 78 or 76. So, yeah, this is a pretty long game, though I knew it would be. It's a role-playing game, obviously. Now we load. Easy. Easy. Hold. 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 Just hold it. Hold it, boys. Hold it. That's a lot of them. Fuck. Not yet. Hold it. Hold, damn it. My God. My God. Just stay still. Stay calm. Deep breaths, man. Deep breaths. Easy. It's a good man. Good man. Just a little longer. Look at their arm. They were expecting us. First troops to the bridge. Break through. Vanguard to the left. And the rest come with me. Just hold. Like the bastards. Hold. At them. Charge, Charge man. Grind those horses into the dirt. For scallets! <laughs> Shit! Oh, that hurt. It's a good hit. It's a good hit. Keep hitting him, boys. Shit, he's got a pole arm. My nemesis. Come on, boys! Come on. Shit, 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 shit. Back off, back off. Don't get stuck in with him. He's down, he's down. Knight's down, knight's down. Come on. Shit. Yeah, he's down. Follow through. Come on. Counterattack. And right there, yeah. Come on. Keep, keep going! Hit him! Hit him! We broke through, boys! We broke through! Polish him off! He's down! Last two! Last two! Or no, last one! Pile on him! 
Defend the fjord! Or forward, actually. It's not fjord. <laughs> oh, they're, they're losing the bridge! There's only three of them! They got through! Help Sir Haim Hanush! Come on, boys! Gotta defend that breakthrough! Close that gap! Come on from behind! Oh shit, that hurt. Come on, come on! And just follow through. Shit. Yeah. He's not lasting long. And he's down. Whew. They did not defend their flank effectively. How many did we lose? What is that guy got the actual yes, branch put through? What? This boy. You should show a little more respect, Divish. <laughs> need it when you kneel before Istvan. Really? <laughs> now the pup shows his teeth. Hmm. Istvan, you say? Not Sir Istvan? Or Lord Toth? Just how intimate are the two of you? <laughs> I know him. He's Eric. Toth's captain and right-hand man. Finally, some good news. Shackle him and guard him closely. Uh, do they counterattack out of the... Those bastards want to destroy our trebuchet. All right. No rest for the weary. I don't think that's the right term, but either way, we're not getting any rest, boys. You want to get paid? You gotta work. So let's move. So we're gonna put away our shit for right now. Increase our move dis uh, speed. Hanish, get your armor on, for God's sakes. Put a helmet. Put a helmet on. I could call my horse, I think. Oh, I could, yeah. Uh, we're not going to do that, though. If I were looking at this right... Oh, shit, we got a long way to go. Fuck it. We'll be the vanguard. We'll meet you there, boys! Follow Hanush! Oh, shit! The hell's going on, Bucephalus? My god! Oh, we can't ride him. Okay, well, you stay there then. I was gonna ride up ahead and archer that, and use my uh, bow and arrow and try and distract them, but that's not okay. That's not gonna happen now. All right, we're almost there. Okay, catch our breath. Catch our breath. I think the Scalots boys are the ones in red. I'm not sure. I forget. Are the ones in... Uh, well, no, it's it's red and yellow. So who's uh, who's are? Okay, they're they're right behind uh, Divish. The red and white are um, they're Tallenberg men, aren't they? Yeah, they're they're Tallenberg men, and the red and or the yellow and black are uh, Rad A men. Coming to meet us here, aren't they? Off to the side. Come on. Try and level up our archery a little bit while we're here. Yeah, right in the chest. <laughs> right in the arm. He's almost dead. He's dead. All right, boys, keep going. 
Keep going. Where's Divish going? Going to the other camp, I, I suspect. Come on. Come on. Let's go. Make sure we don't get, like, rocks pelted down from the, our left side or anything. I see smoke. If they destroy that trebuchet, we're going to be here for another couple of days. And I do not want to be here for another couple of days, damn it. Trebuchet still up. Crossroads is clear. Don't know where the other guys are. I'm hearing them shuffling around, but we might have less than our total uh, complement in this attack. Here they come! It's not a lot. Got one! Right there, yeah, right into the follow through. All right, we're going in. Hanish. I got you, Hanish. I got you. Come on, Hanish, down here, down here. Come on. We got him! He's down, he's down! A couple got through! I think... Or not, I'm not sure. Yep, a couple got through. Fuck it! We're going in. Come on! Yep. Combo him! Combo him! How many left? How many left? We got him. Whew. Oh, good move! That is what I'm talking about. Oh, there's just two guys punching one on the ground back there. Wow. Well? Uh, the damage isn't too serious. So we can shoot? Not just yet. Sir, what are we waiting for? You've heard his threats, Robard. Do you want him to kill Radzik and my wife? We have to consider all our options. And it would be a shame to destroy the castle, too. How do we get that rat out of there? Well, we just destroyed so half his garrison. What about exchanging hostages? He was the captain at Vranjik, and he brought Istvan's reinforcements here. Seems to be on very um, intimate terms with Toth. He might be able to tell us something. And he might even be as valuable to his lord as Lady Stephanie and my father are to us. <laughs> You're your father's son, by God. You're a godson, <laughs> lad. You're right. We'll interrogate this whore, son, and then decide what to do next. Come to my tent when you've rested. Whew, that was a fight. Don't think we took too much damage, but we have, uh, we should have, uh, enough kits to fix everything. Let's check. Armor. Eh, some damage there. Let's try our kits. Uh, there we go. Fix all that. Cobbler's kit, nothing there. Taylor's kit. Okay. And I don't know if the horse has our, if we have any armor's kits. 
We do not. Okay, well that sucks. Uh, why don't we... Got a general goods trader here? I guess we do, but I'm not sure we'll get what we need from him. Um, is there a... We could head to Rade, get our shit, then head back. I think that'd be best. Doesn't seem like it's a timed thing, so let's, uh... Let's go to Rad Ape, get our stuff, then double time it back here, and uh, finish off this quest. We want to be, uh, you know, we want to be uh, looking our best for the final bit of the game. At least I do. So we had two major fights there. Did fairly decently. I like that we switched over to the mace. I think it's better for like that mass combat kind of kind of thing. Okay. And we're here. God be with you. Eddie. Yes, yes. Want to quickly do this? Pick up uh, armor's kit. Maybe. Yeah, pick up armor's kit uh, and uh, a tailor's kit. Armor Smith. I'm at your service. Yeah, let's talk trade. Other, I want an armored kit. Two of those. Okay, and close the deal. It's only 400. Let's talk. I will also repair my armor right now. Actually, you know what? We're going to see if we can repair this stuff ourselves. Why not? Armor kit. Two of these. And okay. Okay, we got everything there. We didn't need to spend any money. We got a blacksmith kit here, small blacksmith kit there. I think everything else, our weapons, are in good order. Oh, tailor's kit. Get this done, then head back up to the siege camp. Tailor. God save you. Let's talk trade. I want a tailor's kit. Let's take both of them. Close the deal. And we'll use these to repair our stuff. Boom. There we go. Looking good. A little blood on our mace, but that's no big deal there. Hear ye, good people. Eh. Got a caller in the center of town. Okay, Bucephalus, you gonna throw me again? Or are we good? Okay, I think we're good. Alright. Alright, let's head back to Talmberg. Energy and nourishment levels are still good. We should get there before the end of the day. Ah, so close, I can taste it. Well, not really, but we're getting close enough. Once we have Toth's severed head, a Toth, no, Toth's severed head in, in, on the ground, then I'll be able to taste it. Not his head, victory. That's what I'm trying to say right now. Don't, don't make it weird. I can, I can just hear the comments now, don't make it weird. All right, let's do the de the debrief or the briefing, I guess. Henry, I'm glad you came. You okay, buddy? All right. Suppose you are. Start talking, or make your peace with God. Do your worst. I won't betray my lord. Ah, Henry! 
just the man I want. This fool would rather hang than sing. You know more about him than we do, so maybe you can get something out of him. I'll try. Well now, Eric. It is Eric, isn't it? Looks like the boot's on the other foot this time, doesn't it? Fuck you. <laughs> you need to change your tone. If you start being nice, you might just come out of this alive. So now I'll ask you a few questions, and you'd better think carefully about how you answer them. I've got better speech than him. My courage isn't that good, but I'm also better at combat. How many men does he got in the castle? How many men does he have in the castle? Enough to thrash you all. What are you people after? What is he after? Are you really that clueless? To destroy Wenceslas' allies. You. Who is this Toth? To you. Who is this Toth? He's an orphan, same as me. The Turks killed his parents, so he started killing Turks. Sigismund needed men like that, so Ishtavan ended up in his service. I'm not going to get this one, I don't think, but we'll try it. How did you meet him? What's that got to do with anything? Yeah, that's true. Who does he work Who for? Who does he take his orders from? Are you stupid? He works for Sigismund. Listen to me. Toth has hostages in the castle, and we have you. So, how about an exchange? Do you take him for a fool? Do you really think he'd give up the only thing he has that stops you from attacking? He'll never accept an exchange. You better pray he will for your own sake, because once we attack, you'll be worthless to us. And what do you suppose will happen to a worthless bandit? I won't waste any more time on you. You could have saved yourself, but apparently you value your master's skin more than your own. I don't need to save myself. Ishtavan will save me. And he'll kill every last one of you! Yeah. Why should he save you? He'll sacrifice you, just like everyone in Vranik and Pribislavitz. You're nothing but a common bandit. You don't know anything. He'll come for me, and anyone who lays a finger on me will pay dearly! Now I'm curious. Why would he care that much about you? Could it be your lovers? You never understand! For a while there, I thought we'd get nothing out of him. But in the end, he spilled his guts. <laughs> I thought you were much too easy on him. But it seems your approach was the right one. Yep. Well, done, lad. well you know, interrogations yeah, and all. That young fellow is no ordinary brigand. And he believes Toth cares about him. We'll just have to see if the bastard cares as much about him as Divish does about his wife and you about your father. Yep. She's making a whole bunch of grush and got nothing to spend it on. Well, Divish. I think the time has come to find out just how much Toth values our hostage. Do you want to parley with him yourself? I think I'll leave that to you, Hamas. So be it. I'll do my utmost. You're leaving Divish to negotiate with words? Sure you just don't want to send, like, a wild boar? Honey badger, maybe. I don't know. They, they Both of those probably have a much better chance of, ne of negotiating. Sir Istvan! What is it? Did our neighborly visit catch you unprepared? A little. But we've settled in nicely. And this fellow is enjoying our company so much, we simply can't get rid of him. It yeah. seems we are in similar situations. Perhaps it's time to send our respective guests home. Not a chance. Do you take me for a fucking fool? Be warned. If anything happens to Eric, I'll let every man jack here have his way with this bitch, and I'll dice Kobila into goulash meat. Nobly spoken, your grace. But for all I know, you may have done that already. Divish, I'm sorry. 
Yeah, we're gonna have to kill him. Greetings, friends. Fear not, Lord Toth is treating us like royalty. <laughs> Always the joke. They're unharmed, as you can see. Always the jokester, Ratzig. Don't try any tricks, or they won't be for long, Hanush. Yeah, maybe, maybe Diva should have negotiated. It seems your lord doesn't place any great value in you, boy. Go to hell. Oh. I'm sorry. It looks like it's not going to be that easy. Well, time to break down the well, castle at least walls. we know they're alive. I didn't expect much of it anyway. He won't harm them as long as we have this fellow. <laughs> so, so we just attack, but then both hostage groups are are, are they can't be harmed because the other hostage group will be killed. So it's just like a it's like a, a well, chicken well, with hostages. What do you suggest? I'd say we have no choice but to attack. Hmm. It's a great risk, Robard, with Stephanie and Radzig inside. I know how you feel, sir, but Toth is no fool. They are his last safeguard. He will do nothing to harm them until he is sure of victory. Would you be saying that if it were your wife inside? Or your father? Well, let me point out that we have no choice anyway. We don't have enough supplies to keep men here for weeks, while gangs of brigands and Sigismund's army roam the countryside. Hmm. Toss won't agree to an exchange, and even if he did, we'd have to let him go. With all his men, he'd be a thorn in our sides till Judgment Day. Sir, a message has arrived. Oh, what is it? Margrave Yobst is approaching with his retinue and wants to speak with you. Yobst, you say? All right. Mm. What's who's, he doing here? Who's Yobst? Who's Yobst? Yobst of Luxembourg is cousin to King Wenceslaus and Sigismund. He's the Margrave of Moravia. Only a year ago, he was collaborating with Sigismund in the League of Lords. He betrayed King Wenceslas and his ally Prokop. Now, he's changed sides, appointed himself the leader of the rebellion against Sigismund, and wants to liberate Wenceslas. Whichever way the wind blows. Nevertheless, it seems the decision is made for us. We don't want Yobst camping with us in front of our own castle like a band of gypsies. Hmm. I'm afraid you're right, Hanush. All right. We'll let the men rest a while and then attack. Come to me when everything is ready. All right. Okay. Well, I mean, we're ready. I'm glad you came. Uh, I your service. service. I'm about to give the order to bombard Talmberg. And since it's mainly thanks to you that we still have a trebuchet, I think you should have the honor of the first shot. <sighs> I'd be delighted. I'd it. To smash my castle? I can't say I share your enthusiasm. Yeah. Sorry, sir. I didn't mean it like that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. that's kind There's of a dick thing to, to say. It. The men will load the trebuchet. All you have to do is pull the lever. Well, I suppose I could manage that. Then we'll bombard Talmberg for several days. Sir Robard will explain what comes next. Okay. Is it loaded? Yep, it's got a stone in there. Or do I have to talk to somebody? How are you, Henry? It's Fayfar might know how to load it. What do you need? We came just in time, didn't we? Quite, quite. I thought my last hour had come. But Lord Capon came to our defense and fought like a lion. I'd say he's growing into a proper nobleman at last. It's good to hear. More people will be changing their minds about him. They should. I owe him my life. God bless him. Okay. Oh, okay. They've got to load it. Can I talk to you My about anything? Greetings. How may I? There was precious little in it, and we could have lost everything. That's how it goes in war. But God stood by us. 
And in the end, they're nothing but a bunch of filthy cutthroats. They're sneak thieves and assassins. But does that make them real soldiers? Well, they no. have to wait till a man nips off into the bushes to relieve himself, lifts up his chainmail tunic and stab him in the back. Personally, I'd rather face a proper soldier. Because you know just who you're up against. That's probably why Toth is giving us such a hard time. Yeah. Almost there, guys. Okay. Now, where is the lever? Or did, no, they need to put a stone in it, don't they? <laughs> I do not envy this man. Ah, old-fashioned trebuchet. Not a catapult. Different, uh, different mechanisms for how they work. Catapult uses the ropes that are like taut uh, to fire. Like you have like a, a bunching a rope down here, and it's like spun, and you have the uh, the actual bit that flings things down like here, and you charge it and then let go, and that's what does it. This uses weights and counterweights to make this work. All right. Let's launch trebuchet. And that's a hit. Yeah. What now? Divish said. Sir Divish. Sir Divish, sure. <clears throat> Sir Divish. Said you tell me what happens next. I, we're going to watch Istran shitting himself. That's all. For a few days at least. So if you have anything to attend to, now's the time. Just don't forget to come back. Okay. So these guys are just going to be flinging. Wait, the two-day bombardment is finished. Okay. Well, I mean, we don't really have anything else to do. Let's. Just wash ourselves here for a bit. Oh yeah, and they're gonna do that. I mean, let's see here. We could, uh, if we go to the map, today. So what time is it? It's almost. Well, it's almost nighttime here. Uh, but if we look at the map, there is a camp of. Uh, of humans here, so we could finish off the side quest there, and then when we're done, that, I mean, that would be it. Wouldn't take us a day to do it. Uh, do we want to go through that? I mean, we don't really need to. We've got, uh, we've got enough money. I mean, we've got 15,000, uh, Groshen on us. We're just flush with gear. We honestly don't need a lot and I'm kind of I kind of just want to finish off the game at this point so we could just do the thing I guess we could uh yeah that book's not really that good for what we're wanting to do uh we, yeah I'm saying we could just go ahead and uh we'll eat out of the uh pots here and we'll just uh we'll sleep we'll take a sleep for better part of the night 12 hours. Nourishment will be at 50, but we can eat out of one of the pots. We'll just wait inside of the uh, siege camp. Nothing else we really need to do. And come on. Okay. And we're just putting stone after stone into them, aren't we? Welcome, Divish. Oh, thank you, Divish. Alright. Eat out of the pot. We're at 50, so that's a little bit more than that. Uh, 
There's another pot here I guess we'll eat out of. Get full uh, nourishment. Actually a little bit more than full nourishment. And then we just wait. Better part of a day. <sighs> Getting so close to the end, guys. So close. I think this, uh, this siege will be the last bit. Probably. Who knows? I'm hoping it'll be the last bit. Almost a full moon. I was gonna see if these stones actually depleted, but it doesn't look like they do. God save you, Henry. And let's watch them fire this. I actually know they need to load it. Yeah. Okay. How often do these uh, pots of stew replenish? Mm, looks like it takes a while. So we still... What is it? It's still two-day bombardment period. It's been... A full... It's been like a day and a half or something like that. So let's go to sleep for the night. Alright. Then, uh, right before this, I'm gonna probably say, I don't know, actually. It'll depend on what, on how long it is until we do the, uh, the siege. We might just, uh, um, we might have the siege and all the battles and the end bit all be its own episode. I'm not sure about that. We'll see how long this episode goes for. With us just waiting for the siege to, uh, to go. Hey, Henry's come to see us. Eat. Brings us up to 90 nourishment. Should be almost done with this. Uh, I wish there was like a timer on it. It'd be great. Is there a timer? That might take days. Hmm. Okay. Well. Let's just... Uh, Let's wait. <sighs> Should be getting close. Cuz it was it was towards the end of the day that we did the uh that we launched the first projectile if I remember right. Okay. Well, looking at that, it'll be a short episode. Because uh, I want this all to be its own episode. The siege, the attack, everything like that. So, thank you for joining me for this episode of Kingdom of Deliverance. If you liked it, please leave a comment down below. So hit that like button. If you want to help support the channel, consider the subscribe button as well. So take a look at the description down below where I have links to my Discord and my Patreon. But I will see you guys in the next and possibly final episode of Kingdom of Deliverance. Bye!